up in our galactic grid activations is a Cassiopeia. And this one, I don't know, here in the central U.S., I see her a lot when I'm outside. But, like, there are so many different cultures who have a mother goddess, and each of them refer to Cassiopeia as their mother goddess. But um, for the sake of us calling her um, Cassiopeia, she was the um, wife of Cepheus, the king of Ethiopia. They had a daughter, very beautiful, named Andromeda. And um, Cassiopeia was very boastful, going around and telling the water nymphs that her and her daughter were more beautiful than their daughters, which they went and complained to Poseidon, and Poseidon got very angry and sent, like, ravaging waters all over their coast and then sent a sea monster. And they decided um, from hearing from an oracle that they should, um, you know, give their daughter the sea monster to stop all this the beautiful Andromeda. So along comes Perseus and he falls in love with um, Andromeda instantly when he sees her there chained by the sea, waiting for the sea monster. And um, so her parents tell Perseus that if, um, if he can save her and kill the sea monster, then he can marry her, which he then proceeds to do and it all has a happy ending. But um, for the sake of what energy do we get from Cassiopeia in the um, in the sky, it's about the divine mother, the divine feminine energy. And that's what is going to come through in this activation. Um, specifically, the things that are going to come in energetically besides like all of the star energy and things like that are connection to all things is sacred, receiving and nurturing, and bringing forth new creations. So those are the main energies that you're going to connect with as you are um, working with Cassiopeia. And remember, each time that we work with the galactic grid, we are healing ourselves and the galaxy. And you can find this at www.sapphirestarcodes.com under Sacred Side Activations.